my show, Amelia's Animals. Today, we're talking about the Amazon River Dolphin. But first, we have to do my quiz, quiz. Every time I make a new episode, we do a quiz, quiz. And our quiz, quiz today is, is the dolphin's brain capacity A. 40% less than a human's, B, 40% more than a human's, or C, about the same as a human's. This will be revealed at the end of the episode. So, let's talk about Amazon River Dolphins. So, to do my show alphabetically, Amazon River Dolphins are R. As they get older, they turn pinker. Because when they're born, they're gray. And they and they do and they go bright pink when they're excited or frightened. They eat crustaceans and fish. They use echolocation. To, to find fish and crustaceans. They also use hairs on their long beak, which is longer than most dolphins' beak, to look for crustaceans in the mud. They can live up to 30 years. They have a hump instead of a dorsal fin. Their main predator is humans, but once in a while, they'll get snapped up by a jaguar or an anaconda, which is a type of snake. They're an indicator species, which means when they're healthy, the river is healthy. They, they're the largest river dolphin. They can look directly behind them by turning their head. That's like you facing your back to someone and then you turning and they tap your shoulder and then you move your head backwards and like you're like yes but better than this. It would be like not looking almost behind you. They have molar teeth, which surprisingly, most dolphins don't have. They sleep with one eye open. For a long time, they were considered a myth. Their biggest threats are habitat loss and pollution. I really hope you can help. You can start by not trapping and relocating animals, riding your bike instead of driving a car, and cleaning up plastic. And now it's time for our quiz with answer. And our quiz with answer is in my book of everything. My book of everything has everything there is to know about animals. Let's look up the Amazon River Dolphin. Let's see, here it is. And the answer is option B. Their brain capacity is 40% more than a human's. That means they're smarter than humans. Sure, they can't make an underwater car on seashells. But maybe if they had arms and legs, they would have created the car. Well, I'll see you in my next episode. Bye!